load a reference image into a camera view. So we can load 2D photos, sketches, drawings into our orthographic cameras as an image plane. This image plane will allow us then to use it as a visual reference while we sculpt or possibly paint, but mostly while we sculpt. So first we need to have a camera and we want the camera to be in one of the orthographic views. So I'm going to come down here and I'm going to look at the side view and I'm going to look through that side view. Now I'm going to go up and create a camera. So I've created a camera. You can see it says camera one here. I'm going to hit the plus sign. I'm going to go to my image plane. I'm going to turn it on and I'm going to import a file. I'm going to scroll down here and just pick on a file. I'll say open and down here uh, I need to come down here and look through this camera and when I look through the camera then I can click on image plane and I can now come down here and change the scale for example and I can uh, translate it so, so I'm going to make this a little smaller I'm going to say 0.5 and so the 0.5 and 0.5 and so I can also change the visibility so I can kind of see through it so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to come down here and I'm just going to kind of change things around a little bit here and I'm just going to go and kind of set it up a little bit as close as I can and remember the visibility is how much we see through, but our depth is I can place on front or in back. So I like to place it in the front so I can see through that, right, as much as I can. And I just want to position this thing so the visibility is to my liking. Um, you know, I can get it so where I want it. And all I got to do then is position my my area and I can use this as a reference to start sculpting. Um, so uh, we can adjust these things a little bit to our liking um, but the whole idea is that we want to edit the position, the visibility and the properties of this image plane so it allows us to have sort of a, um, a reference, a visual reference of the you know the shape of what we're sculpting. So, this is importing a reference image, a 2D plane object, attached to our camera view. And at any time, we can just come over here and turn that off if we don't need it. So, we can just come back, turn it back on. So, you can use that as a reference. And usually, you use that in your sculpting to get um, the proportions of your sculpting correct.